In today's video, we are going to take a look at how we can use AI agents to create trending short form scripts that we then can use to create multilingual video content like this. Get this. Your groovy TikTok dance videos could get you un contrato para publicar un libro. C'est vrai. By Dance, la société mère de TikTok, es entsteht ein ganz neues drama das zum Umblättern einlädt. This can be a good start to a semi-passive income source, so let's take a look. The content we are gonna make today is gonna be tech focused and tech news. So um, the first resource we are gonna pick data from is TechLinked. This is a tech news channel that is a part of Linus Tech Tips. Kind of my favorite, so I wanted to pick that. And we're gonna focus to try to get the latest video. So that's 11 hours ago now. The other resource for data is gonna be a simple Google search for tech. We are gonna search in the news section here, so we get the freshest data. So that's basically the last day, I would say. Some are 40 minutes ago, some are 30 minutes ago, some are one day ago, right? So this is pretty fresh data we are gonna source. Uh, but we're not gonna do this manually. We want to use a Python script to do this uh, autonomously. So we have something to describe the audio we're gonna download from the video. And for that, we are using Whisper. This is an API from OpenAI. And we are using something called uh, YouTube download to get this mp3 file from the video basically with a simple python script and to get the google search we are just going to use something called serp api where we're just going to do our organic uh, google search for news and we're going to set our query so i'm going to show you the query we are going to use here is google search query is going to be tech and the channel name of the youtube channel is going to be techlinked right and we will get the latest video from techlinked Okay, so we have our two data sources, but how do we turn this into useful text? Basically, we are using ChatGPT. So, the first part is you're an expert tech writer. Your task is to find trending topics and write a summary from the data. So, this is taking the transcript from the YouTube video from TechLinked, writing a summary about the trending topics from that. Because we don't want every single part of the transcript. We only want the uh, trending topics and uh, kind of the headlines of the topics. Okay. We are going to create five 60 seconds short form content video script in a very conversational way. That keeps the audience engaged and intrigued. So basically we are now ready to run this. So I'm just going to head over to terminal, run this so you can see how this works in action. Okay. So let's just run the script so you can start. It's starting looking up the search query here. That's going to be tech. It's going to our uh, the latest YouTube video link from um, TechLinked. You can see it downloads the MP3 file and saves it to a file name sound.mp3. And there we have it. So you can see ChatGPT created five different IDs or scripts for our short form content. So this is now getting saved to a file and our AI agent can use this to come up with a few different scripts. And for this, we have created two types of agent. We have one writer agent, we have one TikTok agent. Basically, this is just a TikTok expert agent. So we give them some skills, comprehensive understanding of TikTok algorithm and trends. Yeah, you get the point. The other one is uh, excellent at uh, scripting and storytelling skills, deep understanding of TikTok content trends. It doesn't really like directly help, but it gets both of them onto a path of just focusing on short form content, right? And that is basically what we want. We give them some assignments. So basically read your goals, strive to complete the goals. That is the same for both. Uh, I guess the TikTok agent have different um, goals than the writer agent. So read the context. So the context is going to be those five ideas we just created, right? Those are going to be fed in under here. Discuss with writer agent and improve what five video ideas you would like to create today based on what is most likely to perform the best. Make sure writer agent write five new 8 to 100 word long scripts in their improved form. Check if length is correct, right? The goals for the other agent is basically the same, but use your expert skills to write five new 60 to 80 word long scripts. That is the difference. And yeah. I guess we are just ready to run this. This is all uh, just going to be run in a simple Python code where it's the loop between those two agents. So let's just head over to the terminal and run that. Okay, so here we go. So I'll be starting my assignments now. I look forward to collaborating with you. Let's go over the video ideas based on the current trends and optimize them for better performance on TikTok. 
Should we start with the first idea about YouTube blockers? Okay, so absolutely a TikTok agent. For the first idea, I think we should make it more relatable to TikTok audience. Okay, so you get the point. They're gonna discuss over the ideas they're gonna create. And we let's, let's just this uh, run and we're gonna see what kind of scripts they come up with. Okay, so there we have it. Let's take a quick look here. So you can see it just started out with writing those. Here are the revised and improved scripts based on our discussion. So we have this watching YouTube carefree until bam, strike one for using an ad blocker. No problem, you think, but then, oh no, strike two, panic sets in. So these are the scripts we want, right? Um, so they looked at, la let's verify the word count for each script, make sure they're on with the preferred length of 80 to 100 words. So they looked at every script and everyone was below 50, right? Uh, can you please extend these scripts to at le least a length of 80 words each? And it went to the ad didn't do that, so that was quite good. So yeah, happy with that. So basically now we have our five scripts. We can just pick one, two, whatever you want. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna copy one of those. And we are gonna head over to Eleven Labs to create a voiceover for this. And I'm gonna show you how we can do multilingual voices for this. Okay, so over here on Eleven Labs, we're just gonna take the script we just copied, paste it in and click generate, right? Picture this, you're relaxing casually watching YouTube when suddenly strike one for using an ad blocker. No biggie, you think, but then your heart sinks. Strike two. Okay, so you get the point, right? It's quite good. So this is 23 seconds. That works for a short, I guess. So what we're going to do now is just copy this, head over to ChatGPT, translate this into, let's say, Spanish. So I'm just going to paste in our script here, like this, save and submit. Okay, good. Now we copy the Spanish script, head back to 11 labs, but now we are going to choose here 11 multilingual version 1, paste in our Spanish script, generate. Imagínate esto. Estás relajado viendo casualmente YouTube cuando de repente un golpe por usar un bloqueador de anuncios. Okay, so there you have it. You can do this for every language you want. That is supported by 11 labs. So we have like German, Spanish, French. So basically that's all I need. And yeah, that is how you generate multilingual content from the same script. Now, we just gotta put this into a short form content. So let's head over to Premiere Pro. So you can see here over on Premiere Pro, we basically have a video I just clipped together here, got some footage of um, YouTube. And we have our voice here. So you can, let's take a listen. I think this is German. Hör mal zu, deine lässigen TikTok Tanzvideos könnten dir einen Buchvertrag einbringen. Yes, so let's say now we want to swap this out. So what I have to do is just take this, delete that, bring in the English one, right? Okay, adjust the length, perfect, like this. Delete the captions, go select this, and over here, transcribe, retranscribe, sequence. I'm gonna pick English, transcribe, creating captions, okay, okay. So let's have a listen now. Get this, your groovy TikTok dance videos could get you a book deal. That's right, Bite Dance. Tick yeah, and that was that easy. Like we just swapped out from German uh, voice and German text to English voice and English text. So there you have it, two contents. So you can do this with which kind of languages you want. So I, ha I did four languages. I did Spanish, German, French, and English. So that is kind of four pieces of content just from one. Yeah, that was basically what I wanted to show you today. I think this actually could work if we refine it. We focus a lot on getting good data. We turn it around quickly so we can catch the trends. I think this actually could make us some money. I might try to implement this into some kind of workflow and let's test it like, let's say a few weeks. Uh, I'm actually having a project going on now that is actually testing this. And so far I have some good results. I think I have over 1000 followers on one account and like a lot of views on the other account but uh, no money yet of course but like if I let this grow for a few weeks I think you actually could start making some passive it's not passive income it's like semi passive income it's not a lot of work but you still have to do it right uh, but anyway yeah we're gonna take a look at that maybe in another video thank you for tuning in have a great day and I'll see you again soon